Hey guys, I've noticed online a lot of people are asking how do I adjust my torpedo heater, the uh, heat output, or the pump pressure. So I want to pick this uh, older Remington 35 torpedo heater up on Craigslist. I got it for 20 bucks. I think it's a heck of a deal. It's in perfect condition. 35 meaning 35,000 BTU. Um, it runs off of kerosene. You can also use diesel number one, which is much closer to kerosene than diesel number two. Uh, people say you can run diesel number two, but it'll smoke and really stink up. So I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna try that. I'm just running it off of K1 kerosene. Um, I didn't have a clue how to adjust these, so I read up on them, and basically here's what I've done. The back of the heater, there's two ports. Right here is your pump pressure adjustment. And right here, a little cap. Take the cap off, and that's where you put your uh, pressure gauge at. I just took a little brass fitting that screwed in there, put a little Teflon tape on it, took a little piece of vacuum tubing, and hooked it up to a low pressure fuel pump uh, pressure gauge. The green numbers right here, that's the pump pressure. This one here is supposed to run at 3 PSI. You look down here at the specifications. Pump pressure PSI, 3. So, we're going to give it a shot and I'll show you guys how to adjust it. There's my little dog buddy. So we'll come over here. This one doesn't have a thermostat or on-off switch. You just simply plug it in, and she does the rest. Now you're supposed to let it run. Let it get nice and warm before you adjust the pump pressure. The front of it will start glowing red. Right there. 